do you think? I'm good. <laughs> you look pretty good yourself. I'm a little short here. <laughs> Isn't she stunning? Yes, she is. Did that All right. Well, you do take after me. Gorgeous. Yep. <laughs> <sighs> So today marks our six year anniversary of being together. Uh, we had actually met because my brother was staying with me and I had gotten a call asking if I had chickens missing. Three chickens hitched a ride all the way to his work and were roaming through Chatham. <laughs> and so Gabriel and I load up in the car and we spend our entire day chasing chickens in his work parking lot. And for some reason, Jason thought he needed that kind of chaos in his life. We never did catch the chickens, but we ended up walking away with something a little bit better. Well, I spent the next week or two, I think, looking for them chickens every day that I got off of work. But yeah, being at work, seeing her run around the parking lot, I, I knew there was something about her that I had to have, so. <laughs> I'm glad I had the courage to ask her, and uh, here we are. All worked out great, and uh, I definitely made the first move and uh, hunted down her phone number and all that stuff, and sent her a message and prayed for the best. And for some reason, she messaged me back, and one thing led to another, and. I showed up at your house yep. and got nervous and beamed you in the face with yep. a pillow and left. <laughs> yep, she beat me with a pillow and and uh, yeah, it was love at first sight. <laughs> and then I uh, took off days of work to hang out with her and got really got to know each other and yep, it was pretty awesome. Headed off from there. Yep. <laughs> and that is our amazing story. <laughs> What do we like to do together? Go on adventures. Yeah, yeah, we go on a lot of adventures together. Go and, hiking uh, and... I always, always have to look for things. We have two boys that are really adventurous and it's hard telling what we're going to be up to. So. <laughs> we actually were uh, hiking and we were looking for rocks <laughs> in the bed, the creek bed, and Jason yells at me and says, hey, come here, quick, quick. What'd you so find? I run over there and he pulls out the ring and that's how he proposed. Yeah. And you're looking for rocks covered in mud. I pretended like I dug it up. <laughs> I found treasure <laughs> in more ways than one. <laughs> To the love of my life, I am the luckiest girl in the world to be the one you love and the one you choose to spend the rest of your life with. By tonight, we will be partners in life and love. I am completely confident we will overcome any challenges since we passed the test of wedding planning. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Boy, it wasn't easy, but I'm so thankful I have you here with me. It made me realize how much I want to spend the rest of my life with you and that I cannot imagine spending the rest of my life with anyone other than you. We'll be a hundred years old and I'll be as clingy as I am today. I can't wait to see you. I love you so very much. Hope you're ready. Uh, <laughs> almost your wife, Allison. P.S. Enjoy your manly moment and don't forget to be fancy and swirl at first. <laughs> Open your book and pour them one too.
She said to swirl, right? Oh, be, be fancy. <laughs> Just a, for the show, anyway. I can't promise you that dark clouds will never hover over our lives or that the future will bring us many rainbows, but I can promise you that tomorrow will be perfect or life will be easy. I can promise you my everlasting devotion, my loyalty, my respect, my unconditional love for a lifetime. I can promise that I will always be there for you, to listen to you and to hold your hand, and I'll always do my best to make you happy and to make you feel loved. I can promise that I will see you through any crisis and hope with you, dream with you, build with you, and always cheer you on and encourage you. I can promise that I will share my dreams, my world, my every aspect of my life with you. I will willingly be your protector, your advisor, your counselor, your friend, and your family, and your everything. I love you. One universe, eight planets, depend on who you ask. Seven seas, 195 countries, and we found each other. Since that day, we've fallen in love a little more every day. I take you as you are, loving who you are now and who you are yet to become. I promise to learn with you and grow with you as we work on our marriage and our love. I cannot promise to love you perfectly, but I can promise to love you overwhelmingly until we skid sideways into our graves after a life full of adventure. I cannot promise you an easy life or that I will not disappoint you, but I can promise you that I will choose to love you each day. I see these vows not as promises, but as privileges. I get to laugh with you, I get to cry with you, care for you and share with you and build a home full of laughter, love and learning with you. I promise to respect and support you, to be patient and loving, to be by your side to achieve your dreams and savor our time together. I will keep loving you for the million little things you do that make you unique. I will even be patient when you are hangry. <laughs> <laughs> I will love you for your best qualities and your worst because they make you who you are. May we always find comfort in being together. May we be friends, partners, and lovers for the rest of our days. Allison, I give you this ring. <laughs> With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I will ever be. And all that I'll ever be. Wear it and know. Wear it and now. That I love you. That I love you. With this ring. With this ring. I marry you. I marry you. All right, Allison, <laughs> your turn. Place the ring on his left hand. <laughs> Switch. Okay. Jason, I give you this ring. 
Jason, I give you the string. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I will ever be. And all that I will ever be. Wear it and know. Wear it and know. That I love you. That I love you. With this ring. With this ring. I marry you. I marry you. <laughs> Life, love are the greatest gifts bestowed upon humanity. May your union grant you patience, tolerance, and understanding, as well as the passion and excitement that every marriage should possess. May you need one another, but not out of weakness. May you want one another, but not out of lack. May you support one another as a sign of mutual independence. May you continually rediscover your love for one another as the greatest gift of all. By the power invested in me, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Yay! It is my pleasure to introduce you, Mr. and Mrs. DeCroix. Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs>